I am no longer on the leaderboard. My task for this video is to get back on this goddamn leaderboard and assert my dominance once and for all. In order to do this, I'm going to need a new aimbot. One that's better than the one I made 8 months ago. If you didn't know, about 8 months ago, I attempted to create my own aimbot for aimlab. In that video, I used an approach which checked the colors of the pixel. If it was blue, then we would know that it's a target and thus flick to the target and shoot, rinse and repeat. Now this method had one flaw. In order to know which pixel was blue, you'd need to check every pixel until you found a blue one. This takes a lot of time because on a 1920 by 1080 resolution screen, you'd have to check 2,073,600 pixels, which is a lot of pixels. So how am I going to come up with something faster, you ask? Simple. Machine learning. Instead of checking every pixel for a blue color, I'm going to train a machine learning model to detect the targets instead. For this, I'm going to be using a hard cascade model because it's fast to the point where it works in real time and definitely not because I don't know how to implement any other machine learning models. Basically, hard cascades are classifiers that classifies positive data points which contains the object the AI thinks should be detected based on the positive input we gave to the AI. And then it classifies negative data points which contains the object the AI thinks should not be detected based on the negative input we gave to the AI. The AI then gives us the positive data points which can be used to detect the objects. But there's one slight issue. I've only ever used a pre-trained hard cascade model before and there are no pre-trained hard cascade models that can detect an aim lab target. So based Basically, I'm going to have to make my own hard cascade model that can recognize the aim lab targets from the rest of the things in the background with absolutely no experience in machine learning whatsoever. And then, seemingly out of nowhere, a saving grace descended down from the heavens, the Cascade Trainer GUI, an application that lets you train a hard cascade classify in just a few clicks. All I need to do is feed the hard cascade trainer things it shouldn't detect. For example, the wall, muzzle flash, hit particles, the sky, and much more. This will be our negative data set. I also need to feed it things it should detect. For example, the targets. This will be our positive data set. Now that we have the data, all we have to do is just play with some values and then hit the train button. If you're interested in training your own hard cascade model for object detection, I'll leave a link in the description to where you can download this application. And now it's time to test it. Okay. 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 Oh. We need more negative images. How have I managed to make it worse? Okay, I think it's at a stage where it's pretty accurate now, so let's do the first real test. Bingo. <laughs> Oh, that is not good. And then after 30 minutes of getting more data for the Cascade Classifier, I realized that you could pretty much make the background pitch black and this would make the detection process a lot easier for the AI and I wouldn't have to go through all that pain optimizing the hard Cascade. God, I wanna die. Anyways, here's the run, enjoy.
And with that run, at the time of recording, I am now 6th place on the weekly leaderboard and 59th place on the all-time leaderboard. Safe to say, we've reached our goal for this video and I can finally go to sleep. Anyways, that's it from me and I wish you all good luck on your training.